encouraged by your proactive attitude to opportunities for development, and I urge you to keep up the leadership, teamwork, and drive in order to deliver for the people of Homa Bay, because when Homa Bay wins, Kenya wins. I encourage all investors to move with confidence and engage with the opportunities presented by the county in this conference. The national government stands ready to do its part in facilitating investment at the counties and in leveraging the existing partnership with Homa Bay to provide investors with the best chance to create jobs, create wealth, and expand their enterprises. I am very confident that uh, the more we do this together, the better our country will be. We must all understand, the people of Omabe must understand that each and every person has a contribution to make for Omabe to be a great county. And it is the same. Each and every Kenyan has a contribution to make for us to be the great country that we all want Kenya to be. And therefore, it takes commitment, it takes sacrifice, it takes hard work, it takes working together, collaboration, unity, and pulling together for us to take our country to the next level. I want to tell Kenya from Homa Bay that we have a great country. It is our duty, it is our responsibility to make it greater. And each and every one of us has a contribution to make. I want to ask leaders, those of us who have the privilege to be leaders in Kenya, we are not, the, we are not necessarily the best. It's just that we have an opportunity. Let us work together. Let us build the spirit of unity together. Let us forge what will make this country a better country for all of us. As we discuss the opportunities in Homa Bay, we will be discussing the opportunities in all the other 47 counties, and they are immense. It is for us to work towards building an environment that will give investors the confidence to invest in our country, so that, as I said, we can transform the potential that we have into opportunity and move the opportunities into investments that will then unlock the job opportunities, unlock the wealth creation, and take our country to the next level. So, uh, friends, let me say I am truly delighted to be here. I am sorry I would have come earlier. I tried to excuse myself from uh, coming to Homa Bay this time, but it was not possible, you know. Uh, how difficult it is to say no to Gladys. <laughs> and uh, so uh, she made sure that she called everybody around me and I didn't have peace. <laughs> so I just had to come. Uh, so because I have another engagement, I will not be uh, in a position to take long and to be here. But I want to say that uh, to the people of Homa Bay, uh, we will work with you, we will work with the county government of Homa Bay as we work with the others to make sure that our country is greater. Um, when I came for the campaigns, <clears throat> I slept here. I am, I am probably the only uh, presidential candidate in independent Kenya who does not come from this region, who came and campaigned and slept in Omar Bay. <laughs> and there are things I told you guys, and you thought it was a joke. Now you can see it is not a joke. Sendio. Niliwaambia tutapanga maneno kabisa na hakuna mtu atakuwa loser kwa hii kitu. Tutapanga ndio kila mtu apate ka sehemu kidogo ndio tuende mbele. Si ndio? Si nilisema pale. Pale kwa soko. Eh, amuku niamini siku hiyo lakini sasa maneno inaendelea namna hiyo. So, na tunaomba Mungu ikae namna hiyo. Because I remember very well I told you that time that uh, we, we want to unify the country. We want to work together towards the unity of Kenya. And that is important to all of us, you know? And, and there is space for all of us in Kenya. 
you do not win by making others lose. We want a win-win outcome for all.